Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's me, Corey Says Yo, and uh, today I'm gonna do a simple tutorial and a pretty quick one is that. And um, what it is is how to insert and delete clips on Pinnacle Studio 12. Now, my uh, subscriber wanted to know if you can actually move your clips. Um, you know, these clips right here. If you can move them around freely on your on your um on your timeline I'm sorry you can't do that there's no way you can do that not to my knowledge and um but anyways now I got a little trick I'm gonna show you later in the video show you how to actually do it a lot easier you, you'll be able to move it around freely but it's a little trick I'll show you now the first step is inserting clips this what you need to do is just take your clip that you want to insert and insert it in between your other two clips that you already have and there you go it automatically auto snap and snap everything into place perfectly and you can adjust it to whatever you need what you know whatever you need to be going on there now this is a little trick I wanted to show you let me get rid of this real quick just hit delete and now this is a little trick for the purse I don't know your name but um, whoever whatever you wanted to do with your you said you wanted to move around on the timeline freely well you can do that with a little trick now you just go up here and see I have the T selected you just take a text insert it into your in between two clips and then what you do from there is you take your you know your sizer and make see how it's moving the clip along with the length of the text what that'll do is you can move your clip to wherever you need it to move and once you're done let's say you want to put it at 140 okay we'll come back over here and see okay see it's it's moved directly with where the text length is now what you do is you just right click and you hit delete Oh, my bad. I'm sorry. Delete leave gap. And what this does is you hit delete leave gap and it leaves the entire gap entire gap of the timeline where the length of the text was, it'll leave the entire that length entirely gapped. So that is one way you can actually move your clip around freely on the timeline. I hope this helped you because it was pretty I just actually learned this today. I didn't know I could do this, but Anyways, I thank you for watching. Hope has helped. Thanks for watching. Thumbs up if you can. Subscribe, comment, or send me a message if you need any help at all. I'll try to help to the best of my ability. I thank you all for watching, and y'all have a good night.